All right, guys, I've got 930 local time, so let's go ahead and uh, bust open some packs, shall we? All right. First up, I've watched uh, a bunch of other people open their packs today, so... <laughs> I did not see how Versika did. Can anybody tell me how many legendaries Versika opened? I'm just curious. Uh, I know uh, I know Zoroshio opened like six, but I don't know what uh, Versika did. So all right, the Countess Ashmore. So let's update our legendary count. All right. Uh, six and a hundred and ten is. Mm, yeah, it's a little more than twenty per. I know. Uh, Ender, my son, opened seven in 113 packs. Hi, Aliri. No, I'm so glad you could join us. We're going to open some packs. I just opened my very first pack and pulled Countess Ashmore. Now you're all caught up. All right, pack number two. The Witching Hour. I like that card. Alright, pair of rares, let's see, we're just going to kind of burn through these, um, if you guys are not aware, we are doing a special episode tomorrow night that we call the Alchemy Lab, where we're going to uh, take some of these cards and just kind of start theory crafting decks live on stream tomorrow night. So, a lot of hero power content this week. Should be a lot of fun. There's a silver sword. That's good. I like that card. Hey, there's our first epic. All right. Town Crier. That's a good one. I like that card. the right screen yeah yeah I know I wish you could just space bar through it as well scale worm friend Ashley was trying to creep on the stream so I licked her cheek. <laughs> uh, first legendary Versika was uh, Countess Ashmore. Uh, came out of the very first pack. That's all I've opened thus far. Dan wants a licky licky. Licky licky licky. Lick my cheek. Uh, <laughs> yeah. It's Harry. It is Harry. Alright. Another two rare pack. Another 
<laughs> but that's all I've opened. It's just the one so far. I've only opened the one epic. Rest of it's been uh, forty or forty or sixty. <laughs> oh, there's an epic. Splitting fester root. Oh, you don't... Come on, Versiki. You don't get to see all the legendaries. Ooh. I like the Golden Wing Blast. That is pretty cool. And Wing Blast is one of my favorite cards out of uh, the set. It was one of mine that I picked. So... Let's see. Moving along. Hey, there's legendary number two. Gin Gray Main. So he is your even cost character. Is it Even Hunter or Odd Hunter that's popular right now? Epic number three. So. Another epic. Odd Hunter. Okay. So that's running Baku. Golden Bewitched Guardian. I like the glowing eyes. That's pretty cool looking. Merc Spark Eel. <laughs> the first eight out. Well, you know, it, it could be. Uh, Boyd, thank you for the host. I appreciate that, sir. Golden Ghostly Charger. Uh, it's all right. It would be cooler if his legs were moving. He's just kind of hovering there, though. Yes, I will definitely want to check out the Arugula Mage. That is my second town crier. Coffin Crasher. I love that card. I actually want to see Coffin Crasher in gold. I think that would be fun. Oh, there's an epic. The Gloom Stag. Five for the two six if you're car okay, that's the odd card. Okay. And my second coffin crasher. Sweet. <clears throat> so for sure the ones that I the legendaries that I'm looking for are um Houndmaster Shaw. Um of course the Shutterwalk. Um, I wouldn't I would like to have Lord Godfrey and if not I'll craft who I need to but and I want I actually want both mage legendaries out of this set um, 
Aragal and um, and uh, Toki. Oh crap! What number was that? Seven. Talking and losing count. All right. I'd like to see this Blood Witch in gold too. I love that art. That's probably some of my favorite art in the whole set. Hinch Clan Thug. Blazing Invocation. Those are good. I hear Hinch Clan Thug's been seeing a lot of play in the first eight hours of the set. Hey, double epic pack. I'll take it. Vivid Nightmare. Choose a friendly minion, summon a copy of it with one health remaining. And Cathedral Gargoyle, which we talked about being one of the best, uh, or one of the better Paladin cards. Oh, Versika pulled a Golden Blood Witch. Nice. I'll bet it looks awesome. Thirty-eight packs in thus far. <clears throat> Ooh, golden dark possession. That looks really cool. One mana, deal two damage to a friendly character, discover a demon. I like it. Non-golden dark possession. Mm, excuse me, that cough. Go ahead, take me out. Y'all gang up on Not scale matriarch. Seven mana, four nine. Whenever a friendly minion is healed, summon a three three whelp. I just don't know if big priest is gonna be a thing yet. Apparently, uh, as predicted, Q block is still stupid. So we'll have to see. Yeah. Ooh, Lost Spirit. Now, I like that golden art. That's pretty cool. Of course, pretty art doesn't save the goldens from being dusted to make stuff I need. So. Another Witch's Cauldron. First Mist Wraith. That's pretty cool. Second or third Silver Sword. I think it's just second. Oh, second Golden Lost Spirit. Alright. Well, now I have a set of Golden. So... Cursed Castaway, 6 mana, 5, 3, rush, draw, combo card from your deck. Oh, Golden Common, Darkmire Moonkin. No, my second Mist Wraith. <coughs> Alright, so this is, puts us 50 cards in, or 50 packs in. another epic the baleful banker choose a friendly minion shuffle a copy of it into your deck that's really nice for a 2-2 two -two. 
I think this guy will see a lot of play. Combos. Putting useful other minions back into your deck. Yeah, that'll be good. And he's a neutral, so he can go in a lot of decks. Alright. So right now I am one legendary every 26 packs. For those of you keeping score at home. I know Versica and Zeroshio are paying very close attention to that count. Ooh, golden cheap shot. Nice. And my first holy water. I like that card. Another not scale matriarch. Hey, Tess Greymane. That would be legendary number three. I like this card. I think this will see some use. All right. All of the wing blast. Hey, there's a rat trap. Second holy water. Uh, yet another wing blast. A militia commander. Four mana, two five rush, gain plus three attack this turn. Okay. So the turn it comes into play, it's a five five rush. We are cruising right along. Bog Shaper. Uh, we talked about this card a little bit on the episode the other night. I think it will see some play in combo uh, elemental uh, shaman. I mean, it works well in synergy with Hagatha's hero uh, hero power and a golden dust bat. Hey, first Curio Collector. I like that card. That, my second Golden Wing Blast. I may actually keep the two Golden Wing Blasts. <laughs> Holy Water. Ooh, that Golden Witching Hour is pretty neat. up Mike Lowe in the house eat a piece for me man alright second curio collector so uh, Mike to catch you up we are about 80 packs in and have opened three legendaries thus far. Oh, make that four. Hagatha the Witch. So now I have that hero power synergy we were just talking about with, uh, with the old uh, Bog Shaper. What's up, Salathiel? So, exactly 80 packs in, and we are at four legendaries. Is that right? No, 70 packs in, four legendaries. So, alright. 
second gloom stag. Yeah, we'll see if Hagatha uh, pans out. Not entirely sure just yet if she's going to be useful or not. Grats, Mike. Six legends in 74 packs. That's nice. Very nice. Oh, I was showing it to them. I forgot to bring it back in. All right. Another coffin crasher. Oh, first arcane keysmith. That's good. It's one less card I have to craft because I think that arcane keysmith is going to be good. We we talked about it Wednesday night on the show. You discover a secret and put it directly into play which mage secrets cost three so you're getting a 2-2 two -two body for basically one mana I just I like it I think it's a well designed card oh okay so you got the warrior tower glass knight it was your free hero po okay it was your free card that's cool yeah uh, I want Toki too I think I actually want both of the uh, mage uh, legendaries out of this set. We uh, talked a little bit about the state mage was going to be in. Uh, Zoroshio and I both think it's going to be viable, while uh, uh, Versika said he didn't believe any of the uh, current archetypes were going to be there. So we'll have to see what mage can come up with. I think Elemental Mage is going to be stronger than it previously was because Elemental Mage didn't really lose anything. Most of their cards came from uh, Ungoro anyway. So I'll have to check out which Wood Grizzly. Definitely. Oh, Golden Pumpkin Peasant. I like the purple gas fumes or whatever coming from the pumpkin. That's pretty cool. Hang on. All right, I'm back. All right, let's see. Oh, there's another epic. Hey, all right. My second arcane key smith. That means I don't have to craft any. I don't know. I'm maybe more excited about that than I am the legendary so far. Let's see. Coffin Crasher number four. Book of Spectres. It's the first one of those I've seen. All right. Yeah, I think Keysmith's gonna be good. Earth and Might, okay. I have no idea. There's another Witchwood Grizzly. Hey, Man at Arms. Uh, so far, four legendaries. Um, I'll tell you how far in we are here in a second. 
Uh, we are nine deep packs in at this point, and four legendaries. Golden Gilnean Royal Guard. And it just got really quiet. Hey, Arc Mage Aragul, or as, uh, or as uh, Zoroshio likes to put him, Arc Mage Arugula. So there's one less that I have to craft. You're short. So. <laughs> Arugula the Salad King. Yeah. Glitter Moth, I believe that may be the first one of those we've seen. I want to thank all of you for coming and hanging out with me tonight. Woo! All right. I'm done. I'm done. That's it. I I'm hate done. You. <laughs> uh, I will take it because that is one of the ones I wanted. And to get it golden? Aw, yeah. Although I may craft a golden shutter walk just for when they. Uh, Get around to uh, nerfing it. <laughs> That's right, O'Leary. Golden. <laughs> Versika's just like, eh. Hey, golden rat trap. That looks really kind of cool. <laughs> oh, come on, see me? No booze, no booze. We're happy. Well, I don't know. Do you have booze? Boo. I'd take booze. <laughs> All right, and there's a regular rat trap. All right. 40 packs to go. I am the king of wing blast. I have them all. All right, let's see here. Golden Lost Spirit number three. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what, what to say at this point. They're just, they want me to play all of the Lost Spirits. Rat Catcher. All right. Waiting on the new salad mage list, Zoroshio. Yeah, we'll, uh, Mike, if you're not doing anything tomorrow evening, we're doing a special live stream, uh, of Hero Power called the, um, Alchemy Lab. Join us, um, Zoroshio and Versika will both be, um, theory crafting some decks. So, uh, tomorrow night, yeah, absolutely, uh, right here on this channel, uh, you put your request in now, Zoroshio, you've heard it, tomorrow night on Alchemy Lab, craft mock a, uh, Argyle Mage, so there you go, there's your first task for tomorrow night. It's pronounced arugula. <laughs> <laughs> So, let's see. 
Yeah, we, we like to try to do the Alchemy Labs after uh, new expansions. Gives us some time to theory craft. Let it lets us basically take the reins off of Versica and just get as crazy as he can. So Golden Witchwood Piper. <laughs> Has to be called salad something. <laughs> Uh, oh, Bites opened the lady in white. Oh, sand binder. All right, let's keep going. We this is pack one ten, I believe. So we're getting there. Golden Mad Hatter. I'm not crazy about that card. I could be wrong. It could be great. Oh. Oh. Prince Liam. Not not what you would call a great legendary, but it's a oh great legendary. That's the third time I've used that joke. Or third time I've heard that joke. Because Zoroshio told it once. I told it twice. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Uh, Salathiel, I think Shudderwalk is going to win a lot of Shaman games. It's pretty strong right now. OTK Shaman. Who would have ever thought we'd see a day with OTK Shaman? All right. Hey, golden black cat. It is so cute. Just want to pet it. Man at Arms says Shutterwalk Shaman is the mage quest of this set. I can believe it. That's going to be the deck that carries a lot of people. <laughs> see me says that's why he likes it yeah I can see that <laughs> all right pack 120 we're down to the last few So I had the uh, I had the pre-order of seventy, and then I picked up four packs during the quest. Um, then I got the three for logging in, and then I had six thousand gold saved up. So I started with one hundred and thirty-seven packs. We're down. We're scraping the bottom of the barrel now. May have to uh, pick up some more packs in a couple of weeks. I am going to probably go ahead and craft Shutterwalk and Godfrey it for sure. Because those are two I want to play around with. Um, don't know if there's any others right, that, right off the top of my head that I... Would go out of my way to craft. Uh, 
don't want to miss that shutter walk train. <laughs> it's like, everybody's jumping off the bridge. I guess I'm going to jump off too. Hey, bog shaper number two. Might have to get something going with old uh, Hagatha too. All right. Pack number 130. All right, Blizzard. We got seven packs left. Let's see what we can get. Zerosio says, maybe wrong about Paladin. Bahudin is wrecking the legend ladder right now. Interesting. Hey, I got a golden blood witch. I was right. It does look awesome. I might keep that card too. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, Baku did. Gotcha. Baku Paladin. I might have to craft Baku. Rat Catcher number two. All right, last pack. Here we go. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, well. We did okay. Six legendaries, one golden, 25 epics, and one golden epic. So I came in with 4,135. And I will be... Gaining an additional 3,640 dust just in my duplicates. So that puts me to 7,775. Two away from hitting that slot machine winning number of 7777. All right, let's take a look at which wood. And our legendary. All right. So Splinter Graft was the card I got for logging in. That was my gift legendary. Uh, we talked about this card on the show. Not very good, we think. Just too expensive. Houndmaster Shaw. This was one of the cards I wanted. Really happy. Uh... To pull this, even more happy that it's golden. Uh, Argyle, uh, gonna talk. Join us tomorrow night as we uh, theory craft, and uh, we will talk about Argyle some tomorrow night. Uh, that will be Versica and Zeroshio. I will be producing that. I've got some stuff going on tomorrow night, so I won't be be able to join them on air, but I will be hosting that and producing that so make sure you check it out uh prince liam don't know we'll have to wait and see uh wait for the meta to shake out right now i don't like it i don't like that it gets rid of all your one cost cards because some of paladin's most powerful stuff is in that slot with all their secrets o'leary have a great night thank you for joining us um, Tess Greyman, I like her a lot, and I like playing Rogue. I'm going to see if I can find some way to make her work. Hagatha, you know what, while we're here, just going to go ahead and do that. And Shutterwalk, all right. I uh, did not pull either of the Warlock legendaries didn't pull either of the warrior legendaries 
And then we got Gin and Countess Ashmore, which I like Countess Ashmore. I actually rated her, I think, fairly high. Um, seven mana, six, six, battle cry, draw a rush, life steal, and death rattle card from your deck. Um, I, I think she's going to be fun in this, uh, she's going to be as much fun in this, uh, meta as, uh, Curator was. So, we will see. All right. Well, that's going to do it. I didn't pull either of the Priest Legendaries. Uh, still missing Toki. And, yeah, it's okay that I'm missing Duskfallen Aviana. I won't cry. I promise. Face Collector. I need to get Face Collector. Alright, guys. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for joining me. It was a lot of fun. Um, like I said, make sure you check out uh, Alchemy Lab tomorrow night. Uh, if you're not already following us, uh, give this channel a follow to be alerted when that show goes live tomorrow night. And uh, we'll see you then. Until then, good gaming. And don't forget to use your hero power.